Hello, it's Miss Hansen here, and we are into our second music lesson together virtually. Today we are going to work with one of my favorite songs. It's called Bee Bee Bumblebee. Um, this lesson is suitable for my younger students, kindergarten, grade one, grade two, maybe grade three. Um, I will also be posting a second video for the older kids, so look out for that. I'll put all the links down below. Um, for this lesson, I'm just hoping that the students will follow along at home and participate as best they can. If you want to record any of their participation and send it to me, you, that would be amazing. You can do it through Google Classroom and I'll put the information for that down below as well. Or you can email it to me. Um, I also would just love to hear from anybody, so drop me a line via email or through the Google Classroom. Um, this song is called Bee Bee Bumblebee, and first I'm going to teach you how to sing it. It sounds like this. Bee Bee Bumblebee stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. This is actually a game that I'm going to teach you in a, in a couple of minutes, but let's, lear, let's learn the song first. So I'm going to sing a phrase and then you're going to echo me. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Okay, now we're going to do it again, but I'm going to do a longer phrase before it's your turn. So wait for me to point to you. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee. Stung a pig upon his snout, I declare that you are out. Okay, now let's try singing it together. So I'm going to sing the whole way through again, and you need to join in at home, please. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. And if you're paying attention to the, to the pitches, you might notice that it's only using two pitches back and forth. Then at the very end of the song, we drop to our, our one and only low sound. It's a do. So let's try and sing that again together. And I'm going to move my hand to help you with the pitches. You can move your hand with me if you want to. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Nice job. Okay, next I want to make sure that you can keep the beat along with the song while you sing because you're going to need, need to keep the beat in order to play the game. So this time um, I'm going to tap the beat lightly on my table, but maybe you should put the beat in your lap. Let's try it. Here we go. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Okay, so hopefully you've got the song now and you've got uh, the beat figured out because now I'm going to invite in some classmates to play the game with us because it's just me here today. I don't have my regular class, so I had to, I had to improvise. So you might want to pause the video and go get some classmates of your own to play the game with. I borrowed these from my daughter. She has about 50 of them. So I invited just a few to come in today to play the game with us. And finally, I have a bee. Now, some of you might remember in my classroom, I actually have a bee puppet. Do you remember it? You wear it on your hand like a glove. I wish I had grabbed it when I was at school. Um, but luckily, my daughter also had a little bumblebee stuffy, so I'm going to use that for today. So what you want to do for this game is you want to sing the song. And as you sing the song, you want to tap the beat on the heads of your classmates, in which case, these six stuffies. So I'm going to take my little bee puppet, and as I sing the song, I'm following the beat, not the way the words go. So let me show you what I mean. You're going to go like this. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, 
So my bumblebee is following the beat. It, the beat, remember, is always steady. The beat never changes. What you don't want to do is follow the way the words go. That's wrong. I'll show you the wrong way to do it. Bee, bee, bumblebee stung a man upon his knee. So that's me following the words. I'm bopping along on every syllable, which is not what we want to do, right? We want to feel that steady beat. Bee, bee, bumblebee. Okay, so what's going to happen is my bee is going to keep the beat on the heads of the class, and at the end of the song, wherever the bee finishes, we are going to eliminate that stuffy out of the class. So we're going to play six rounds here together. Um, so hopefully you have grabbed yourself maybe six stuffies, or you can do more if you want to. You can have as big of a class as you want. Um, but we'll do six here in the video together. Okay, are you ready? Here we go. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Okay, we've eliminated this guy. In fact, he has a name. This is Tulip. Goodbye, Tulip. And the rest of our classmates reorganize themselves. Okay, here we go. I'll start right here this time. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Oh, who did we get this time? Scrappy has been eliminated from the game. Luckily, they're quiet over there, not making noise while I continue the game with the other students. Okay, here we go. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Oh, say goodbye to this little dragon. His name, or she, this is Darla. Goodbye, Darla. Okay, we're down to three. Here we go. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. Oh, say goodbye to Leanne. I don't even know what this is. Maybe it's a... A fox? But it has a pretty long tail. I don't know. Goodbye, Leanne. And we're down to the final two. We have Bubby the rabbit and Twinkle the sheep. Here we go. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. And the sheep named Twinkle was eliminated, so that means Bubby the Rabbit is the big winner. Okay, that was pretty fun. So in the next part of the video, I am going to be showing you a few different uh, variations on the game. We're going to add some instruments in, and um, we might even sing one more B song before it's time to go. Okay, here we go. On your screen, you should see a whole lot of bees. Um, I'm going to sing the song and track it for you, and hopefully you'll see how the bees relate to the music. Bee, bee, bumblebee, stung a man upon his knee, stung a pig upon his snout. I declare that you are out. So hopefully you've noticed that these larger bees take up a whole beat, and these smaller bees, uh, each half of each bee is half of a beat. So that, that means that these are taws and these are titis, of course. So let's try singing the song using ta and titi together. Ready, here we go. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta. Ti, 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 ta. Ti, 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 ta. Ti, 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 ta. Awesome job. Let's try clapping it as we sing it this time. Here we go. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta. Ti, 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 ta. Ti, 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 ta. Ti, 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 ta. Awesome job. Now, why don't you go and grab something to use as an instrument? I have a can of peanuts and a plastic straw. And I'm gonna tap the beat 
of the, or the way the rhythm goes of the song while I sing it and I can probably even track it on the screen for you too. So pause the video and go get something. Okay, are you ready? One, two, sing and play, go. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta, ti, 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 ta, ti, 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 ta, ti, 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 ta. Oh, so good. Let's do it one more time. And this time I'm not gonna sing. I'm just gonna track it for you and we'll play the rhythm on our instruments together. Ready? One, two, here we go. Awesome job. Okay, before we leave each other today, let's do one more song together. This one is called Bringing Home My Baby Bumblebee, and you might know it because it's super famous. Um, I find when we are singing songs that are really famous, um, your version might be different from my version. So I'm gonna teach you mine, and maybe someday you can show me your version if you know a different one. You could even um, send me a video on Google Classroom or through email. So it goes like this. There are some actions, everybody. Close up your hands like this and take a peek inside because do you know what's in there? Your baby bumblebee. Here we go. I'm bringing home my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm bringing home my baby bumblebee. Ow! It stung me. So now we're mad. You gotta sing with a mad voice. Ready? I'm squishing up my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm squishing up my baby bumblebee. Ew, there's blood on me. Now this part's really fun. Make sure you're only pretending to do the next part. Don't actually lick your hands. Ready guys? I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Mmm, strawberry. Another fun way is to sing the licking verse with your tongue out like this. I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Mmm, strawberry. So you do that however you want to do it. But remember, don't actually lick your hands because that's disgusting. Okay, we're going to sing it once more. I'm going to add in my ukulele this time so it's more cheerful and fun. So please join me and do the actions um, at your house. Here we go. I'm bringing home my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm bringing home my baby bumblebee. Ow! It stung me. I'm squishing up my baby. blood on me. I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Won't my mommy be so proud of me? I'm licking up my baby bumblebee. Mmm, strawberry. Okay, thanks for singing with me today and I hope you guys have a great week and I will see you next time.